A Chicago police officer is facing criminal charges tonight and now a civil lawsuit in connection with a deadly crash that happened near the House of Blues. Nate Rogers spoke to the victim's family's attorney tonight. Nate. And that's right, Scott and Don. The victim's family says they're relieved to learn of these charges, but they still have a lot of questions. An attorney representing the family says he'll now file a wrongful death lawsuit against any and all bars right here in River North that may have served the suspect alcohol the night of. Take a good look at your screen. Chicago police officer, 40-year-old Tangi Brown's charges include aggravated DUI, accidental death, failure to render aid, and reckless driving. She turned her into authorities today. The victim is 56 year old Maria Schwab, affectionately known as Tony. She was a 30 year educator and Texas native in Chicago on a work trip before being struck by Brown's vehicle here in River North. It came out in the, uh, the hearing today in criminal court that uh, a bar in River North Treehouse had served alcohol and under the Illinois Dram Shop Act, they are responsible for uh, the reckless conduct of Tangi Brown. If there were other bars involved and there were media reports about that, we're going to find out about it and add them to the case. The crash happened December 7th of last year, although off-duty at the time, reports indicate a CPD holiday party was happening near the House of Blues where the crash occurred. It's unknown if Brown attended that event. Initially, she said she dropped her cell phone while inside her Infiniti SUV and went to retrieve it. Eventually, her vehicle jumped the curb, crashing into Schwab and Schwab's co-worker. The beloved mother and wife died at Northwestern Hospital. I now know that she was tested immediately after, not immediately after, actually if two hours later at a hospital and uh, her blood alcohol content was in excess of the legal limit in Illinois two hours later. Wow. So it would have been a lot more uh, if she was tested right after. Now, Brown was relieved of her police powers the day of the crash. She started as a police officer in 2008. She was assigned to the 18th district near North. We know that she's due back in court on February 20th. In River North, I'm Nate Rogers, Fox 32 Chicago.